I've got the Rainbird 5004 Plus Partial Circle Rotor here. 5000 series of rotors are some of our most popular rotors and the Plus models are the upgraded version. We're going to talk about a few of the features, show you how to change out a nozzle, and make some adjustments. I'm Dwayne Smith, your Sprinkler Warehouse Product Specialist. Let's get started. This is the 5004 PLPC Adjustable Arc Rotor. PL stands for plus, which means that it has flow shutoff capability, which allows you to shut off the flow of water to the individual heads. So you can work on the head without turning off your system or work on the next head over without getting wet. The PC stands for partial circle. That means it has an adjustable arc, also known as the pattern. The arc is adjustable from 40 to 360 degrees. There's also a full circle version of this rotor available. That is the 5004 PLFC. The pattern on a 5004 PLFC is not adjustable. It only goes around in a continuous 360 degree arc. The pop-up height on this rotor is four inches and it has a three quarter inch inlet. The rotor comes with this set of rain curtain nozzles. It has a watering distance of 25 to 50 feet, depending on the nozzle installed and how the adjustment screw is set. The 5000 series of rotors are also known for their longevity. Rainbird rotors have the longest operating life cycle of any rotor on the market. Looking at the top of the rotor, this little raised area is where you set the radius adjustment screw. You can use the Rainbird tool like this or a small flathead screwdriver. This is the pull up slot. You'll need to use one of these for that. Over here is the arc adjustment slot. That's where you set your pattern. And right in the center is your flow shutoff slot where you turn off the water. Let's go outside and check out one of these in the field. There's two basic ways to access the nozzle while the rotor's in the ground. One method is to pull up the riser by inserting a rainbird tool in the pull-up slot. Since this rotor has flow stop, another way to access the nozzle is to turn on the zone and shut off the water to the head using the flow stop slot. The riser stays in the up position, which makes it easy to work on. Whichever method you choose, you'll need to back out the radius adjustment screw. Once it's out of the way of the nozzle, pull out the nozzle with a pair of needle nose pliers or pry it out with a flathead screwdriver. Insert the new nozzle and screw back down the radius adjustment screw. Don't try to tighten the screw, you're just getting it down in front of the nozzle to hold it in place. Now start the water either by turning on the zone or by using the flow shutoff slot. Use the radius adjustment screw to set your watering distance. The spray from this rotor should reach the next rotor over. To adjust the arc, also called the pattern, insert the Rainbird tool or a small flathead screwdriver into the arc adjustment slot. Turn clockwise to increase the arc or counterclockwise to decrease. Rainbird Rotors will give you years of reliable service. Order your 5004 PLPCs today on sprinklerwarehouse.com. Remember, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything you need to make your trees, lawn, flower beds, and gardens lush and beautiful. Questions? Chat with one of our incredible customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really do know their stuff and they'll get you squared away. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for helpful tips, tutorials, and general sprinkler instruction. Sprinkler Warehouse, America's most shop sprinkler store.